I'm going to show you how to set up a Power World server using Apex Hosting. The first thing you want to do is click on the second link in the description, which is going to bring you to the Apex Hosting website. And if you do this right now, you'll get 25% off using that first link in the description. Once you're over here, you want to click where it says order now, or you could also click view more if this first option is not the one for you. I do recommend the more popular one, which is the eight gigabyte uh, server. This is going to allow you to have a little bit more players if you need to. Okay. So let's go ahead and do this one, the eight gigabyte, or you could also do the six gigabyte and just click order more. Of course, you could change the currency in here. If you were using euros or whatever, it's the, your country currency, you could change it in here, but we're just going to leave it in dollars and we're going to use the eight gigabytes. Go ahead and click where it says order now. Once you find the server that you like, give it a second for it to load. Once you're over here, you're going to have to select the server location. Where is it that you want your server to be running at? For example, I live in Texas, so I'm going to have my server running in Dallas, Texas. That way I have the best connection to my server. Obviously, we're going to select the server version, which is just Power World. Obviously, there's a bunch of other different games in here. But for this case, we're just going to do the Power World one. You're going to scroll down and you're going to change the admin password, which is the password that you're going to use via the console to control the server. In the server description, you could add anything that you want because this is what your friends are going to see when they join the server as a server description. For the public server name, obviously you can name this whatever you want. I'm going to name it Apex Hosting Power World. Just so you guys know, this is my server. Let's go ahead and fix that name. And then down here, you could change a couple of things. You could add a couple of stuff like adding permission setup, premium support. If you need that premium support where they instantly communicate with you, you could change a couple of things in here. Maybe add mod pack. So you could do this with a mod pack, create the server with the mod pack. I don't recommend that you do that right now because there's not a lot of mod packs for Power World, you know, it's a fairly recent game. And just feel free to read through these and see if these are things that you might need now or you might need them later. I might as well add them right now to your server creation. Now, one of the options that you also have is whenever you configure in your billing cycle, which is how you're going to pay the server, you could do this quarterly. So you only pay this every four months, three to four months instead of having to pay monthly. And I don't know why I feel like that's a better way to do this, but for this video, I'm going to leave it in monthly. Also, something I forgot to mention is that you could get a dedicated IP address if you want that for your server. It is a $4 charge, but you will get this dedicated IP address that your friends could use to join. And, you know, it's the only IP address for your server. Then you click continue right here. Give it a second for it to load. And then you'll be over here in the review and checkout section where you could review your products. And as you can see here, since we have that 25% off, we actually get eight dollars off our first order which is great you know for 23 dollars getting a server set up where you don't have to actually do anything because the server is running 24 7 i think it's a fair deal then you're gonna click where it says checkout and then it's gonna bring you a little bit forward where you're gonna actually create your account i recommend that you save that email address as well as the password that you use for later on whenever you need to control your server do anything that you need to do you have that safe somewhere also you could access this through your phone as well so later on if you need to access the server console you could access the server console for Apex hosting through your phone, which I think, you know what? It's a great feature. You could be away from home and you could control your server. And then once you're ready to pay, just scroll down and click where it says complete order. Obviously click that you have read and agree the terms of service. If not, it's not going to let you complete the order. Just click complete order and that's it. You have a new server set up. It's going to give you a dedicated IP address so your friends could join. And that's it. You have a server running. It's instantly like that. It goes online and you are done. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, don't forget to leave a like and a comment. And as always, bye bye.